Okay, I know I've been radio silent for like three months, but I can explain. <laughs> okay, so to start with, um, I am aware that I have not been on this app in a hot minute, and I'm pretty sure you've been aware too, and first off, I would like to come and apologize for not updating as often as I should have, but I can explain. Never mind, no I can't, I am a hyperfixating procrastinator and there is nothing else to it. If it makes you feel any better, I wasn't really trying to ignore you. I haven't really been writing either. Cause, uh, writer slump, am I right? It, it sucks. It sucks. But today, um, I got some people to scream at me to write and I wrote for 45 minutes and I ended up writing 240 words and did some light editing and you know what? I want to say that's not as great as it could be But it is the best that I've done in the past few months combined. So we're gonna say it's a win But yeah, so this is just an update on the whole writing process because I haven't really had any videos about writing recently either but I am hoping to get back into something that remotely resembles a normal healthy writing schedule and if all goes well and I manage to not procrastinate my days away like I have been doing for the entire summer so far, I will have the third draft done by the time summer is over. Please peer pressure me into doing that, like just, just do anything, scream at me, comment and peer pressure me into doing it. I need that pressure, I'm sorry, it has gone to the point where it is ridiculous. I think that's all I came on here to say, but I just want you guys to know, I, I promise I am trying so hard to fight against this stupid brain of mine, okay? So, hopefully things start to look up from here. Oh, and I know that you guys were all shocked when I didn't post anything for Speak Now TV. Like, I was shocked too, but I, I am unwell from it. I was screeching, I was kicking my feet. I'm still trying to recover from that. Long live Taylor's version as promised. Simultaneously destroyed me and put me back together again. I need electric touch running through my veins. When Emma falls in love made me realize that I want to be described as if Cleopatra grew up in a small town. I can see you gave me the opportunity to pretend that I have a non-fictional high school hallway crush. Um, Castle's crumbling, absolutely devastating. Track five worthy in my opinion, not okay. Um, Foolish One, written about me, again, Taylor, without my permission, very called out by it, and Timeless, Timeless is for an Olivia song, make of that what you will, I'm running out of time.